YouTube is Miss Cal here. This is the third video in the series of my investigation into sodium silicate as a type of uh, lacquer or liquid polish on stone. Um, I prefer the term lacquer because that's sort of more how it is working. Um, to give you an idea of what I'm trying to emulate, seen in a video on uh, Ben's channel Uncharted X where he um, shows the evidence for a liquid that has been applied to the stone boxes that have been found under um, the Serapium at Saqqara, Egypt and uh, I'm, I'm, I'm forming the opinion that this is what they used because it would be easy to manufacture and um, it's just the products of fire and, and silicon that can create uh, sodium silicates or potassium silicates depending on the source of the, um, the donor caustic material but um, yeah that looks wet it's dry check this out and that was put on there about half an hour ago there's been three applications I think it is of straight sodium silicate on that one I'll continue to build up the layers um, and where I think uh, the most important discovery will be is in this one here vermiculite in a sock just like French polish this is the vision I had when I watched the video um, and I've got a pretty good feeling that this is how they did it because you can use dilute sodium silicate concentrated stuff would have been harder for them to make the dilute stuff would have been easier and how much does this look like French polishing like vermiculite even looks like shellac and this was applied about two minutes ago and I think that's already set up it's it's quite fast and I've also noticed that if you breathe on it it happens quicker so there's the co2 being sequestered from the environment it's a little bit tacky there but it's actually dry over here so yeah, it, it really does work. What do you think? Do you think they used liquid polish uh, in antiquity? Feel free to give suggestions on things I should try. Um, don't forget to rate. Give the thumbs up for the algorithm. Comment as well. That helps it all. Um, share it amongst anyone that's... Uh, involved in the what do you call investigations of megalithic builders and yeah catch you on the next one